Hi, my name is Soheb, and today I'll be teaching you guys a few expressions that mean to calm down or relax. So the first expression I'm going to be teaching you guys is chill, or another way of saying it is chilled out. Now, when our bodies get cold, oftentimes we don't move as much. Whenever the weather gets cold, we're not, we tend to become lazy. That's why in English, we often uh, associate some adjectives that describe the weather as being cold to being calm or relaxed. So for example, here we're using chill or chilled out. Now here are some examples of how you can use these expressions. Let's start with chill. It's my day off, I'm going to chill. You see how in a normal setting that would sound kind of weird, but since we know we're trying to explain how to, that we're calm or that we're relaxed, we can say this and it will be appropriate. Another way of uh, saying chill is chilled out. Now an example of chilled out will be, I chilled out at home last night. Or you can say, I chilled out at home last night and was watching TV, explaining what you were doing. Another way of saying chill is describing someone as being chill. For example, Adnan is a very chill guy. So now that you know chill and chilled out, why don't I teach you another way of saying to relax? Take it easy. Now with chill and chilled out, you can use it to describe both being calm and being relaxed. With take it easy, we often associate it with being relaxed more than actually being calm. Now, some examples of how to say take it easy. After school, I'm going to take it easy. I love to take it easy on the weekend. You see what I mean as it's more associated with being relaxed or doing something that makes you relax. I went on a trip last, month, last week and this week I'm going to take it easy, have a day off. You see what I'm saying? Well, with chill and chill out, we can use chill and chill out both for being calm and also being relaxed. If you want someone to be calm, you can say, you know, chill, chill out. Or if you're describing that you're relaxed, you can say, I'm chill. The last expression I'm going to teach you guys is give it a rest. Sometimes you're in an argument or in a fight and you need to tell someone to calm down. So this is a very good expression to use in such a moment. So some examples of give it a rest are, give it a rest a leap. You don't even need to add any words in front or behind give it a rest. You can use it as its own sentence. Another example, you have been complaining all week. Why don't you give it a rest? As you can see, both of these situations, they seem a bit aggressive. So we tend to use give it a rest when someone is aggressively coming at you. So I've taught you guys three ways to tell someone to calm down or relax, or to explain that you're calm or relaxed. They were chilled or chilled out, take it easy, or give it a rest. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, share, and comment below on what you thought about it. Also, if you'd like to take my class, you can go to your nearest Lingo Center and sign up now. Thank you for watching. Bye.